the driver information interface on select models can provide a variety of content. It's operated with the steering wheel mounted switches on the left hand side of the wheel. To cycle through the available displays, repeatedly depress the display button. When you see the icon of the display you want, press the enter button to see detailed information. For instance, you can select the turbo icon shown here on model so equipped. A turbo meter appears, showing the amount of boost pressure being created by the turbocharger. You can customize which types of content are displayed and the order in which they're displayed. From the display audio home screen, touch settings, then system, and then configuration of instrument panel. To change the order in which the icons appear, touch edit order. Select the icon you want to move, arrows will appear on each side of the icon. You can use the arrows to move the icon to the position you desire. When done, select OK. If you would like to delete an icon, touch delete. The icons that can be deleted will appear with an X in their upper right hand corner. Select the icon and touch OK to delete it from the display order. To add an icon, touch Add. Select the icon you want to add, and a plus mark will appear in its upper right hand corner. Then touch OK to add it. The steering wheel mounted controls let you operate the audio system and Bluetooth hands free link while keeping your hands on the wheel. And since the driver information interface is closer to your line of sight while driving, it helps minimize the potential for driver distraction. After selecting the audio icon, press the up or down arrows to cycle through the available audio sources. After selecting the desired source, you can use the up and down arrows to move through radio presets, folders, available tracks, etc., depending upon the source chosen. And you can use the plus minus bar to adjust the audio system volume.